festivities. We got Chase here from SLC Foodie, and you've got some holiday spots that we just have to check out. Thanks I for do. coming in on yeah. Christmas Eve. Yeah, I got my hat on and everything, you look so great. I'm ready. <laughs> So what what qualifies as a holiday spot? Uh, really, the decor is really? really what I was going for. It's something that gets you in the holiday spirit, either Christmas lights or you know cr neat decorations around the building. You know, around the holidays, yeah. it really does get you down if there aren't any Christmas trees or Christmas decor in a place. Yeah, so this completely. is great. They yeah, I've been listening to like Christmas try. music probably since the end, beginning of November. Oh, so. really? You're ready. You're <laughs> yeah, like in I'm the ready. spirit. <laughs> yeah. so, so what's your favorite? Uh, I would, let's start with Bambara. Um, Bambara is downtown, right by City Creek. You have the Temple Square lights. Um, really neat food here. Um, more of a fine dining feel. So this is maybe a uh, mom and dad day spot, possibly. Oh, yeah. They have this neat, um, it's called the Miracle Bar right next to it, and it has a holiday overlay. There's only 80 of them throughout the country, and the, everything in there is decorated. You can see the photo here when it rotates Oh to my it, gosh, right that is so cool. Yeah, really neat. The windows are frosted out. It's, it's a fun ex experience. That is so neat. So yeah. it's all cozy and yeah, holiday. Yeah, yeah, neat menu too. The, the chef there, he kind of has creative control. What you saw there was an elk loin and a filet. Oh, so, wow, yeah, yummy, yeah, yeah, fancy. Yummy flavors, yeah. <laughs> So if you want to splurge a little bit, yeah. What's another one you like? Uh, so this one is for all my North Utah people. Oh uh, yeah, are you friends. Northern Utah? No, no. So I don't get up there very often. Mm -hmm. So I'm talking. This is in Farmington. It's called oh, awesome. um, Farmington Station. This restaurant is called Tortilla Union. Uh, first one in the state. They only have one other. I, I believe it's in Washington or Oregon. But they have. Southwest food. See these nachos mm. right here? L literally layered manchego cheese <laughs> through it, carne asada, their tacos. Those tacos are huge. I should have like put a fork next to them. Yeah, so you can see the To scale. give perspective. <laughs> I could, like, I eat a lot and I could barely get through two of those. Yeah. Well, this is great. It's kind of nice to have a place where you can just splurge. Yeah, well, and the neatest part about here is Farmington Station has that neat water fountain. I think it was made by the same guy that did the Bellagio fountain. Oh. So it shoots up different colors of lights. It's, it, yeah, it's a neat experience. Station Park is nice because they have pretty much everything you need. Yeah, there. it's you beautiful up there. Shopping, last minute shopping. I had no idea it existed. <laughs> it's, it's, it's a lot of fun, actually. The, these are great. Keep yeah. them coming. Let's go so with the next the one. The next one, I you know, they, they have a Christmas tree in their lobby, right? It's but this is more to save money, right? Oh, so I love I, to save money. <laughs> yeah, You're me too. To the right girl. <laughs> <laughs> um, so this one's up in. It's called Wasatch Broiler. It's up in Fort Union by that Century 16 movie theater up there. Yes. Yeah, and so this right here, what you're looking at is their trout, right? Twelve dollars with the soft drink for that trout. No like I way. Worked, I it was expecting something that you know looked like it came out of a freezer bag. Yes. I was like literally like. Do you floored. think it's well sourced I, and all that? Yeah, yeah. I, I, I'm not, I don't know how they do it, quite honestly. I felt like I should have paid more. Yeah. Um, so I went back during dinner to see how the dinner menu was, because they're known for kebabs. That's what it says all over their menu. Oh. So I had their kebabs. That's the other photo that was on there. Uh, steak, shrimp, and chicken. And usually I hate chicken kebabs because they're dry. Oh, yeah. I don't know how they did it, but amazing food there. Really? And yeah, and I guess it used to have quite a few locations, and now they've kind of consolidated just up there, but uh, really fun experience and something that uh, I, I want to say they've been around for almost 20 years. That is so good yeah. to know because I've seen that place when I've gone to yeah. a movie okay, and yeah. wondered how they are, so it seems yeah. like the perfect place if yeah. you take the whole family out to a movie, oh, definitely. you're broke, yeah. <laughs> go there for lunch, you can get a great trout. Yeah, <laughs> what definitely. are you doing for Christmas? Uh, you know, going to... you have to a, a big family dinner? Yeah, family dinner, family movie, all that fun stuff. Oh, yeah. fun. Yeah, I, well, what were you going to say? No, I was going to say, I try not to pick where we go. <laughs> yeah, you're like, I'm actually not working. Today. Yeah, so I'm anyway. done. <laughs> yeah. Well, if people want to follow your foodie adventures, yeah. how do they yeah. find you? SLC Foodie on Instagram or SLC Foodie UT on Facebook. And we actually have a website coming in 2019, so I'll share that with you in my next visit. Wow, yeah. I'm so excited. Well, yeah. thank you for the good tips. Yeah, of course. Lots of good stuff thank to you. catch today for dinner or lunch or all of this holiday week. Rich, are you hungry yet? <laughs>